Welcome back. The NGX closed on a positive note amid sell-offs and buy interest as the benchmark oil share index is appreciated by 98 basis point. The NGX CSI closed at 50,126.41 points to reflect growth of 0.98% from the previous trading day and a year-to-date return of 17.35%. Meanwhile, the market capitalization grew by 262.80 billion naira. At the close of market on Wednesday, 4 May 2022, the stock market exchange value currently stands at 27.02 trillion naira at the end of the trading day. The market breadth closed positive as Wema Bank led 31 gainers and 27 losers topped by Oando at the end of the day session. Market sentiment trend towards the bulls with the market differential being in favor of the advancers as 31 gainers surpassed 27 losers. And now looking at the all sharing desk, I, we had it at 50,126.41 and then for the deals, 7,251 deals. The volume stands at 669.30 million. And for the value, 5.99 billion naira. The market capitalization closed at 27.02 trillion naira. And now a quick look at the gainers on the day. For the day, that's the 4th of May. We have Wema Bank, which last closed at 3 naira 50 kobo, with 10% increase closed yesterday at 3 naira 85 kobo. Okumo Oil last closed at 147 naira, but with 10% increase, we have it closing yesterday at 161 naira 70 kobo. NB last closed at 57 naira 10 kobo, but with 9.8% increase closed yesterday at 62 naira 80 kobo. Presco 143 naira 40 kobo, but with 9.97% increase closed yesterday at 157 naira 17 co 70 kobo. For Itana, which last closed at 6 naira 2 kobo, with 9.97%, last closed yesterday at 6 naira 62 kobo. And a quick look at the decliners. For Oando, which last closed at 6 naira 30 kobo, with a depreciation of 10%, closed at 5 naira 67 kobo. For Transex PR, which last closed at 81 kobo, had a minus 9.88%, and then it closed yesterday at 73 kobo. Mansard, which had 2 naira 44 kobo, had minus 7.79%, and that made it close yesterday at 2 naira 25 kobo. Ikeja Hotel, which last closed at 1 naira 40 kobo, had minus 7.14%, and that of course made it close at 1 naira 30 kobo. Qtex, which is the final one on the table, last closed at 2 naira 44 kobo, but with minus 6.5% uh, closed yesterday at 2 naira 29 kobo. And joining me is Ambrose Omojon, Chief Research Officer, Invest Data Consulting. Um, good to have you on the show. Good morning. Yeah, good morning, Irene. All right, welcome. Let's start with a review of the stock market. First, investors in the Nigeria equities market gained 262 billion on Wednesday as all share index closed above 50,000. How would you describe the current positive sentiment in the market? Well, you know, it said that uh, what you need to positive uh, you know, sentiment at the buying trade in the medium and high cap stocks. And that has put the price of equity, as you don't mention, above the benchmark index of 50,000. It shows that at this rate, the market, the you know, Nigerian market is becoming so emotive, so performing on the best market in Africa and all over the world as a street. This will consider the rally in the month of the April, and that is needed to the top trading day of the month of May. Yes, you know that market has gone to the government. As we speak now, 
Thank you. Now on the Guinness list, Wema Bank led 31 other stocks with a 10% gain to close at 3 Naira 85 Kobo. What do you think led to this gain? But the shares of Okumo Oil was up 10% to close at 161.70 on Wednesday, while Presco gained 9.97% to close at 157.70 Kobo as well. What level of support do these stocks enjoy from investors? All right, and now let's look at Nigeria breweries. Talk to us about the shares of Nigeria breweries because we had the price jump by 9.98% to close at 62 Naira 80 Kobo. I didn't get that. What did you say? All right, all right. Now moving. You 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 were going to say something? No, no, go ahead. All right. Now the shares of Itana are up by 9.97 percent to close at six naira sixty-two Kobo. Do you see the stock sustaining this for long? And uh, why do you think investors will continue to hold their positions? All right, now on the flip side, let's uh, look at Oando shares, which declined by 10% to close at 5 now, 67 Kobo. And then we also have Mansard declining by 7.79% to close at 2 now, 25 Kobo. What do you suppose is the reason for this negative sentiment? Yeah, for Oando, for, for I would say uh, for Oando, I think it's a pretty stock. And Oando no, declining is not surprising to me because they're about to profit again. 
but at the same time, the outcome of the digital equity digital meeting don't show that uh, the numbers, uh, 2019 number and also 2022, 2020 number might not be positive and uh, you know, for investors who hope for anything. And that's why it's coming up. But for me, for those that are medium and long-term investors, you don't want to do anything to do by Naira. It's a good price for you to enter because what is happening in the, in the oil sector, especially the positive sentiment for positive, uh, uh, positive fundamental issues, and that's also what in part one, though, especially when they start delivering their they are 2021 and 2022 earnings. That means if you are, you know, in the one who don't to panic out, if you're not going to invest, you're going to for data. But for those that are thinking medium and long term, for the one who comes to that uh, site, and for me, it's become become attractive because that's a fundamental use for the sector where the one is operating to a for the company. The set that has from 2021 financials of this company, which is still improvement, unless they want to sell the market to another. But for the trend, we're seeing globally, both international companies and look at what's that. Thank you for that beautiful analysis. Now, what should expect? What should investors expect today in the market? Yeah, we are seeing the positive trend in the market. The market has signaled it's almost already been about a zero point zero three percent. The market being about one hundred and fifty four point two zero points. It means that the market is in green. I think the trend will continue. That's why the market area, the 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 kind of big hype in the in US and other markets today. That I think in England also like to. Thank you, Ambrose Amodion, CRO Invest Data Consulting, for being a part of Business Breakfast.